Hi, I'm Heather with McQuay Stables. One of the most important parts about showing is how your horse's braids look, and I'm gonna give you some quick tips on how to braid a mane. To start with, you wanna wet the mane down, wet so it lays nicely and it's easy to hold on to. Comb or your clip, whichever you prefer, and you measure out the width you want the braid to be, and then you use it, the comb also to pin back the mane. You grab your three pieces and you start laying them over. As soon as you get your three pieces laid over, you start counting. So you, I count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight strands, and then I lay the piece of yarn in and then I catch down another eight strands. You tie it over, wrap it around, and pull down. And then you double knot it at the bottom to secure it in. So once you have it braided down some, you take your pull through and you stick it in through the middle and you pull your, main, your yarn up through so it comes out the top of the braid. And then you pull your braid up like that in a little bun. You wrap it around. Double knot it on the top. You give it a little bump. Pull it tight. Double knot it again and wrap it around the bottom again to secure it. And then you do two single knots extra. to keep the braid in there tight. And then you take your scissors and you snip off on the sides. If your horse doesn't rub too badly, you can leave them in overnight. Most people take them out the same day and they get rebraided each night that they show, or each day that they show. It's tough on the manes if you leave them in for too long because if you braid them tight, the horses tend to rub them more and some like young horses don't like their manes being braided and will rub them and then it rubs out their mane as well. We wash the manes twice a week, scrub them good. If you don't rinse it well, it tends to make it itchy and they will tend to rub their mane more often. When taking out the braids, be careful not to rip the mane out. Be patient, it takes a long time to get your braids really tight, so don't be discouraged. Your fingers will hurt the first few times, but just keep practicing. It takes a lot of practice. If you have any more questions or need more info, check out SmartPack's blog at smartpack.com.